Hi, this is Mel from Mesa, Arizona, and talking about Boswellia trees, also known as the frankincense tree. This is a Sacra Boswellia tree here. I got this as a seedling, and that's the best way to uh, to start one is to get it from seedling. They will grow from the seed, but the problem is is that most of the seeds in the United States, uh, only one percent maybe will uh, actually produce a tree if you buy in lots of seeds. Uh, so it's actually best to either uh, do a seedling or if you can get a cutting, you get a section of a cutting, then you can uh, root that out and they will root out that and that's the way most of your Boswellia trees are grown is from, um, from cuttings. Uh, eventually you can make uh, oil from these. You uh, have to scar the, 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 the trunk and it'll uh, have a sap that comes out of it and that's your uh, frankincense. Um, It'll come out and harden, and then you take that and you grind it up, and you add it to uh, your some of the different oils. That they, there's different oils you can add to it, to, depending on what type of um, uh, treatment you're trying to get. So they can use um, almond oil, they can use sunflower oil, and they um, grind the, uh, the crystals up and they put them into the the oil, and that's the way they make the uh, Boswellia oils. And it makes it uh, really good for healing and for joint pains and that you can rub onto different areas of the body. But uh, if you have any questions about um, Boswellia trees or um, uh, where to grow them, this one's actually growing in Mesa, Arizona, and uh, I just started growing. It's been about a year old. It was about it's grown about doubled in size in the last year, so they are kind of a slow-growing tree. If you have any questions or anything like that, please put them in the comments. Also in the comments, if you can put down where you're watching this video from, it's always interesting to see how far away these videos reach. And if you uh, like this video, if you could give me a thumbs up, I'd appreciate it. And then um, if you hit the subscribe button and the bell, then it'll notify you when we do other future videos on different tropical plants. And thank you for watching and have a great day.